hey guys welcome back to another video now today we are in negril jamaica and we are at the west end or in found on the west end side about 12 to 15 minutes drive from rick's cafe now this property hmm this resort two sides of the road to take up people so we have left side and right side of the property and we're going to make our way on the right side first because this is where we have the office we have some accommodations and we have the caribbean sea hey kitty kitty how you doing so let's get right into it and let me show you all of what this beautiful resort has to offer and by the way it's not all inclusive but hey it's worth it so upon entering we see that there is there are lots and lots of beautiful flowers beautiful plants sculptures and so on and of course at the office we are observing protocols so sanitize make sure you have on your mask and then you can enter into this beautiful little reception area now Ashanti the receptionist who was on duty while I was there she was superb and she gave me the reins because I was treated like VIP people yes I was so I was able to go in and showcase all of this to you with not a problem so over here we have items for sale sculptures and all and to the left inside here you can find a restroom that you can use and also we have a couple of shelves with items that you can purchase so at the bottom here we have some hand carvings made from wood and yes beautiful they are and top shelf are items that you may have forgotten to take with you or maybe you stay so long that they finish and you need some more so you could come in here and purchase these items and they are affordable and you will notice that wood is a feature that is used throughout and that's something that you'll see on this property yes people place nice bad now we're going to explore the rest of the property and we just passed one of the big bad chefs but we're going to go back to him in a little bit now property is clean property is well manicured and well well kept people well kept now quick story when we got here we got here after nine in the night and guys kitchen was closed place was packed up but guess what parchi made it happen because the chef came out and they prepared dinner for us and we were able to go to bed with a full belly and we never did for hungry people now let's take a look at the room that we were in each veranda has a balcony and a little sitting area chairs and a table on the inside when we open this lovely wooden door we have Tada! chair it's a standard room we have a television on the wall we have bedside tables with bedside lamps bed of course and a standard bathroom now we're back on the outside and i must i must say that the staff here is great i mentioned parchi already and i mentioned ashanti i soon tell you about the other people now looking around this property we can see that it has this rustic feel it's not an all-inclusive hotel which means that you'll have to purchase your meals but people the price the price is very very affordable and i'm not talking about rich people affordable i'm talking about me and you kind of affordable yes with a pocket not always so strong now we're going to take a look down to this side and by now you're able to see the cliff you're able to see the caribbean sea and because we're on the cliff side they have made an area that has beach sand and we have a salt water pool so for people like me who are afraid to go into the sea then this part is just for us so we get the experience without having to risk to risk it all yes now we are heading up back and 
where we have this building to the left this is the bar on this side of the property where you can have any kind of drink and you can make your food order which will be sent over to the kitchen for it to be prepared now we're heading down and we have some string the lights which is very very beautiful in the night and right here we have a fresh water pool which is an infinity pool and people if you can't swim they have seats in there for you to just sit down and just nice up yourself into the water yes and we have a second fresh water pool so guess what we don't have to crowd there is space for everybody to enjoy themselves now I'm going to show you one of the things that stood out for me as well now we're heading up to the fire pit and guys every Sunday night West Ender Inn has a what they call it again a bonfire people yes a bonfire where you can roast your marshmallows and stick or your frankfurt or anything you like and just relax and enjoy the vibe watch caribbean sea now this is another view where we have a salt water pool and we have a staircase leading down into the sea so if you want to go and snorkel like a little missy out there then the sea is all yours for the taking but remember the sign that we saw before you swim at your own risk so you have to make sure that you can actually swim yes look at her showing off her skills girl one day i will be just like you don't worry remember the other side that's where we're headed now now guys coming through these gates to the immediate right we have the security post and this area is made of nice bamboo yes well done and over here we have pool we have bar we have the kitchen we have the dining area and to the far left there's a road that takes you around to the private cottages yes people they have private cottage around there now the pool is found upstairs but it was closed off while we were there and guys once again we we'll meet the big bad chef going out to deliver food now when we head inside we see that there are just so many little beautiful touches to the place it's not overdone we have lawn chairs now as i said i was treated like vip so even when they were they were closed off at the front i was able to come in and get a shot look at alex people alex made sure that we did not die of hunger that night when we came in he was so courteous he was so gracious we also have natasha who runs off the bar and she takes our food order and guys walking around and showing you this beautiful place has made the worms start to carry on with a bag of things so we're just going to go outside and have some food breakfast time and guys look at my plate i have some fried dumplings i don't that potato something tastes so good but i don't know what it is and some scrambled eggs and mr man had a fruit plate now guys you need to check out this place if you're in a grill i just want to thank you so much for tuning in to another video please remember to like comment share and subscribe thank you guys